What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, welcome, my um, all the new new people that just joined in. Uh, I hope the channel helps you. It gives you some type of clarity um, or entertainment value. I hope you enjoy the channel. Uh, welcome in everybody else. Um, we're currently at 99.76 right now, so 24 away from 10,000 mark. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. Um, so once we get there, I'm going to do the uh, live, I'm going to do a live video of the raffle drawing. So, um, and I, I did get your text today, ma'am, and I responded back to you about wanting to enter the raffle. I've got you down, just to let you know. Um, I did respond, but I just want to let you know. Um, so I just wanted to say that off the bat because that's coming in close. Um, this is a free general collective reading, Capsule Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time, is, excuse me, <coughs> excuse me. Time is fluid, energy is fluid. <clears throat> if it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Free general collective reading. So it's very important. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Okay, so the channeling I received was um, serious lies that were told about an Aquarius, a Leo, a Virgo, and a Sagittarius are about to be revealed in a huge way. The truth is about to be exposed. Um, and um, their names have been drugged in the mud, but they are about to be, um, they are about to be, um, I heard exonerated, exonerated. Um, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I mean, I have a general, I have a general idea of what that means, but, um, I'm assuming, uh, the lies set to truth, um, ex exonerated is like a legal term. Hold on a second. Exonerated, absolved from blame or for a fault or wrongdoing, especially after due consideration. Okay, exonerated. Absolved from blame for a fault or wrongdoing, especially after due consideration of the case. That's what exonerated means. Um, and I heard exonerated. Um, like I said, I had to Google it um, to give you guys the definition. So. You plug it in however that resonates. So I heard some serious lies were told about a Leo, a Virgo, a Sagittarius, and an Aquarius. So you could be the Leo, Virgo, Sag, or Aquarius, or somebody connected to these people. However, that resonates um, in one slide. Um, some serious lies were told about these people. Um, but I heard basically after um, the truth, real truth is about to come out. The real truth is about to come out. And basically, um, once the real truth comes out, and it sounds like it's about to come out soon and quick, after the real truth comes out, um, the, the lies will be absolved, the truth will come out, and their names will be exonerated. So exonerated, um, like I said, I'll read it one more time, exonerated via dictionary. Um, dot com absolved from blame for a fault or wrongdoing especially after due consideration of the case so i think somebody was trying you could be the leo virgo aquarius or um sag but somebody was trying to run these people's name through the mud i think in the, in a community either online or in a physical physical community or both um it could be masculine or femme leo aquarius sag or virgo um, but basically, um, I think somebody's doing an investigation or they're about to do an investigation and, um, they're about to, um, realize these people didn't do it. Um, and it was other people is what I'm presuming. Other people for sure. The tables are about to turn in a huge way. Okay, I heard other people for sure. The tables are about to turn in a huge way. Oh, my Lord. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So somebody was trying to, if the, if you're the Leo, Virgo, Sag, or Aquarius, they were trying to blame you for something. Um, in some shape, form, or fashion, 
Um, I heard other people for sure, and the tables are about to turn in a huge way. Um, Aries, Cancer, Libra. Aries, Cancer, Libra is what I heard. And Gemini. Aries, Cancer, Libra, and Gemini. Um, Aries, Cancer, Libra, Gemini. And Pisces. And Pisces. Aries, Cancer, Libra, Gemini, Pisces. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. So we've got four signs over here that it sounds like these person or people were trying to blame for something. Um, but it's about to be found out. It sounds like through an investigation or some kind of investigative process or something. However, that resonates that it really wasn't these people. It was this person or people. We have, um, ooh, oh my goodness, um, Cancer, Aries, Libra, Cancer, Aries, Libra, Pisces, and Gemini. Cancer, Aries, Libra, Pisces, Gemini. But they, this person or people were trying to blame these people, person or people. However, that resonates. Um, wow. Um, it sounds like some truth is, um, I heard truth's about to be exposed. It's about to be exposed. So that's why I think this is about to go on. Um, so you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you, this sounds like a big thing. This sounds like a big, big thing. Um, however this resonates in the universe. Um, how it, um, and Scorpio. And Scorpio. And Scorpio. Um, and Scorpio. Okay, so. Aries, Cancer, Libra, Gemini, Pisces, Scorpio. And then we have, that's on the ones I'm assuming that either, I think these people ran these people's name through the mud and they really did it, but they wanted to blame it on these people is what I'm presuming. That's what I'm presuming. Um, over here we have Sag, Leo, Virgo, and Can um, not Cancer, Sag, Leo, Virgo, and Aquarius, Aquarius, and then um, these these six signs. Now, for some cases, it could be one person over here. For some, it could be six. For some, it could be 600 because, you know, it could be like 100 Scorpios and 50 Cancers or what have you. You have to plug in your life however it resonates. Same goes for this side, too. Those, these are just the, sides I, um, the signs I heard on the sides. So you plug it in however that resonates, that resonates for you. This, um... This is going to turn into a huge thing. Very, 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 very public. Very. By the end of it. Okay, I heard this is going to turn into a huge, huge thing. Very, very public by the end of it. So this, it sounds like there was blame game going on over here. Blame game. Um... It could have been falsification of documents, possibly, blame game, slandering into the ground, um, all kinds of crazy chaos type energy. Um, but I heard um, it's going to turn into a very public thing um, after, basically after it's all said and done down the line. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. Good Lord have mercy. Um, extremes, I think these people went to extremes um, to try to slander these people's name into the ground um, or to blame them for something they didn't do um, in some shape, form, or fashion. Some very important, very, 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 very important documentation is about to be presented very, very soon. Irrefutable. Okay, I heard some very, very, very important documentation is about to be um, presented soon, irrefutable. So some some kind of, now irrefutable, for anybody who doesn't know, basically is you cannot deny, cannot deny the documentation. So um, I don't have to Google that. I know I know that for sure, for sure. Um, so irrefutable means you cannot deny it, basically. So some kind of irrefutable documentation. So not altered documentation, not behind the scenes changed documentation. Some real, true, ir like cannot deny it documentation is about to be presented in some shape, form, or fashion soon, somewhere um, in the universe regarding this situation um, where you cannot deny it. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. But I feel these people went to extremes 
to try to alter it or doctor it or cover it up or something. A huge, huge, huge cover up there, but it's about to be exposed. It already has been. Okay, I heard a huge, huge, huge cover up there, but it's about to be exposed. Um, it already has been. So extremes, um, these people went through a huge ordeal, basically, to cover um, cover something up. But um, And they harm people in the process, a lot of people. And they're about to wish they never did. Oh my God, this is terrible. And I heard they harmed a lot of people in the process um, and they're going to wish they never did. So these, these person or people, however this plugs in your life, um, I heard harmed a lot of people in the process trying to cover up some kind of um, cover up energy of some kind of documentation um, and some kind of truth. Um, but I heard, uh, and they went to extremes to do it, but I heard basically um, they're going to wish they never did by the end of this. So you plug it in, however that resonates. This is, good Lord, this is, Lord. Spirit messages you have to like Growth. The masculine on the bottom of the deck. There's going to be lawsuits here for some of these people. For some of these people, they're currently in court situations. Okay, I heard there's going to be lawsuits here for some of these people. And for some of these people, they're currently in court situations. A particular masculine energy is about to become very, very significant in a lot of these people's lives. Stolen money, stolen property. Lots are, is about to be revealed. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. Wow. Okay, I heard stolen money, so stolen property, lots is about to be revealed. A particular masculine energy is about to become very significant in a lot of these people's lives. So these people's lives, these people's lives, um, a lot of people's lives. Um, I feel this masculine energy is probably like emperor status, um, but not abuse of power status. At least God, I hope not. Um, hopefully he manifests and homes his abuse of um, his power in a very positive copacetic way and not an abuse of power kind of way but he's about to become very very significant in um these people's lives and these people's lives um which i think is going to um i heard lots of uh, stolen money and stolen property so these people stole money or property and they blamed it on either stole it from this person or people or tried to blame these person or people because they stole the money and property that sounds like fifth grade right there, but um, you plug it in how it resonates. But this person sounds like they're about to become very, very significant. And uncovering this cover up is what I'm feeling. Very significant. Your shit's about to hit the fan. Okay, I heard very significant and the shit's about to hit the fan. So this masculine energy, I feel it is a masculine energy or it could be a fan that takes on heavy masculine. You plug it in how it resonates. This could be you or somebody you're connected to. It's either a masculine energy or a fan that takes on heavy masculine. However, that resonates. I heard they're about to become very, very significant in this. I think this might be an investigator. Um, this might be a governmental entity agency like Fed Energy or something of that nature or either CIA, you know, or CIA or something like this because it's criminal. It's criminal level for sure, for sure. Um, it might be a judge. It might be um, a politician or something. I mean, I don't, somebody, somebody with high authority to sort this crap out, basically. 
Um, cause this is a hot mess express. It really, really is. Um, either a femme that takes on heavy masculine or a masculine, however that resonates. But, um, they're, I think they're about to uncover all this. They're about to uncover it or help uncover it. Her, the shit's about to hit the fan. So, um, they are about to uncover it and make the shit hit the fan, um, but in a positive way, which is going to lead to growth. Um, I think for these people, because their name were slandered into the mud so bad, um, and it's going to lead to growth and prosperity for these people, is what I'm feeling. Lead to growth and prosperity and abundance. Block, block, block. Okay, I heard lead to growth, prosperity, and abundance. Block, 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 block. So these people have been um, blocked. Block, block, block. Uh, so it's going to lead to growth, prosperity, and abundance for these people. They have been blocked in some shape, form, or fashion. We have... Um, uh, who did we have? Aquarius, um, Virgo, Leo, and um, Sag, I think. Aquarius, Virgo, Leo, and Sag over here. Um, somehow these people have been blocked in some shape, form, or fashion in the universe. I think these people, person or people, had something to do with it. Um, and But it's about to lead to growth and prosperity for these people um, because they've been getting blocking energy, blocking energy, blocking energy. Sounds like they're about to be free in some shape, form, or fashion. I feel this might be, um, I heard some are currently in legal situations and some are about to be in the middle of lawsuits. I mean, it's that serious. Um, I think this might be a judge. This might be a lawyer. This might be um, an investigator. This might be the feds. This might be governmental entity agency energy. I mean, you plug it in how it resonates, but this person is not, play, they're not going to mess around. Um, for some, it might be more than one person in this energy. How this resonates in your situation. But I heard the shit's going to hit the fan. So, um, because these people have stole, stolen property and large amounts of money from these person or people. Um, so yeah, I can see how that's a huge imbalance. That's huge, huge, huge imbalance. Um, huge imbalance. The scales are going to, going to start to be balanced soon after many series of chain events. Okay, I heard the scales are going to start being balanced soon after many series of chain events. So um, the scales are going to um, start being balanced soon after many series of chain events. So the justice scales are going to start being balanced like Libra and energy um, after many series of chain events because these people have been left out in the cold, I think, either money, time, energy, or love is what I'm feeling in some shape, form, or fashion because these people have taken it. They, I mean, I heard money and property specifically in here. Large amounts of money and property, but it also could be time, it could be energy, and it, or it could be love. However that resonates um, in one's life. I heard the um, justice scales are about to be balanced soon. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Let's see if I hear anything else. This card just keeps calling to me. Taurian and Libra and energy. And Aquarian energy here. To balance the scales. This has turned into a huge thing. Oh my God. Okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard Torin, Libran, and uh, who's the other one? Torin, Libran, and um, hold on a second. Taurus, Libra, and there was another one. I forgot. Give me a second. I forget the other one. Taurus, Libra, and something. Um, who was the other one? Aquarius. Taurus, Libra, and Aquarius energy. 
Taurus, Libra, and Aquarius energy to help balance the scales. So Taurus, Libra, and Aquarius energy to help balance the scales because I heard it's turned into a huge thing. So it could be masculine energies that are Taurus, Libra, and Aquarius um, going to come help balance the scales, or it could be Fems that take on heavy masculine energy that are Taurus, Libra, or Aquarius to help balance the scales because I heard it's turned into a huge thing. But in all fairness, it sounds like there's a huge imbalance here. Sounds like these people are taking it all and leaving these people out in the cold. Uh, whether whether it's time, money, energy, or love, I mean, it's it's it does. It sounds very un, imbalanced. Um, but I heard these people are going to get growth after many series of shame events. I think after these people um, get involved and start um, balancing things out, I think these people are very high in the community or in their world in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, I'm serious. I heard Taurus, Libra, and Aquarius. Um, so these people, it could be three people or 300 people, but they have Taurus, Libra, or Aquarius in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Fourth Dome, and Hamburg, Jupiter charts. I feel they are, they're, they're top dog, high energies, um, high vibrational energies, hopefully high vibrational and not abuse of power, hopefully. Um, but I heard they're about to get involved in um, balance the scales. So hopefully they will do a fair, just job of it, hopefully. Um, you plug it in however that resonates, um, which is going to give growth to these person or people, um, and help them, um, because it sounds like they, they were sold from in some huge way. And I mean, I'm serious. Um, so much so you got them up here and these people down here because these people were stole from so badly. I heard properties and large amounts of money. I mean, it, you're not talking twenty dollars out of your mom's purse. You're talking about very, very, very large investments here. Very large. Um, this is. Whew, let's see if I hear anything else. Okay, I didn't. I didn't hear anything else. All right, you guys. Well, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices. Okay, hold on. These people feel that they don't have to work for it. But they're about to get a huge wake-up call. Huge. Okay, I heard these people don't feel like they have to work for it, but they're about to get a huge wake-up call. Huge. So I'm assuming these people feel they don't have to work for the money that they stole because um, they're, they're criminals and thieves. Um, but I heard they're about to get a huge wake-up call. So they have stolen money and property from these person or people, um, but they're about to get a huge wake-up call. Um, this might be police. This might be police. This might be feds. This might be investigators. This might be a judge. I mean, I'm not sure. You have to plug it in how it resonates. Maybe you're these people. Maybe your police investigators are the judge in this energy coming in this coming to this situation soon. Um, possibly. I mean, I'm I didn't hear from the spiritual realm that was that. It's just my deductive logic and reasoning, possibly, that that might be the energy of this. Because this is big. This is real, real big. It's real big. <clears throat> but heard these people um feel like they don't have to work for it. They don't, they, that they basically stole, 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 and took, 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 took to the point, drained these people dry. They don't feel, they don't, they feel they don't have to work for it because they stole, stole it from person, people, place, et cetera, et cetera. But basically they're about to get a huge wake up call. Now, if, you know, if you're one of these signs and you don't resonate up here, don't get offended. I just want to throw that out there. Okay. This is somebody in the universe. So you have to plug it in your life however it resonates. If you are not, you know, if you're one of those signs and you're up here and you're, please don't get offended. That just means it's not you, okay? Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but it's going to give these people growth. It sounds like they need it because uh, they were sold from, sold from so badly. Um, Lord, all right. All right, I didn't hear anything else. I didn't hear anything else. 
And that's really sad that people feel like they don't have to work for things. I just want to throw that out there. It's really sad when people feel like they don't have to work for, for anything. I worked hard for every single thing I've ever had in life. Every single thing. Everything. Uh, I work hard in the spiritual realm. I work hard in the 3D. I've always worked hard. I'm a 38-year-old woman. I've worked really, really, really hard for everything I've ever had. So I think it's really sad where people have that mindset. They feel like they don't have to work hard for things. But they can just steal it and be a criminal and get away with it um, and not have to work hard for it. That's, that's really sad. It's sad. All right. I love you guys so much. Everybody made wonderful choices. And namaste. We're only 30 people away from 10,000. So just let you guys know. As soon as we get there, we'll do the drawing. Love you guys. I'm going to say.